Okay, what I'm doing here is uh, I'm messing around with my uh, SDR hardware and software. Um, software wise, I'm using the um, SDR console version 3, and I'm going to start with just using my RTL dongle. Now, these are very cheap, these. Um, I'll show you a picture of one now. Um, as I say, it's just a little tiny little dongle. These are very cheap. They're between about 10 and 30 odd pounds. You can get them very cheap. They've got a limited range and bandwidth they can use. But uh, if you want to learn about signals and stuff like that, really cheap to get into. Really good starting point. Get used to the software and all that. Now, what I'm doing here is I'm looking at the 868 um, part of the spectrum which is uh, rather quite interesting as you can see there's quite a lot of activity going on here as you can see this this really makes the RTL dongle and there seems to be some kind of uh, beam going across here you know um, fortunately with the uh, RTL dongle you can't see a lot of the bandwidth at one time you can see there's quite a lot of interesting activity going around here. Uh, I'm not too sure what these are. Let's see if we can get better. On the signal here, you can see it's just... So this is kind of like pulsing going on. As I said, I'm not really an expert, so I don't really understand all of this. Um, but it's really quite interesting to look at. You know, I would, say, I would definitely say there's some kind of radar activity, just as a guess. Now we'll stop that, and I'll actually flip it onto my. Uh, bum bum bum. Uh, up to my hack RF, which I'll show a picture of. So hack RF, you can actually. This is a lot more expensive. These are about I don't know anything between about 150 to 350 pounds. But obviously, you can uh, detect more of the uh, spectrum, and you can also transmit with these things. Which uh, with these as well, so far more interesting to play with. But again, if you're getting inter interested in this, start off with a little dongle and then move on to something better equipment uh, if, if that's your thing and you're interested in it. Right, again back to this 868. I might have to turn it down a little bit. So the settings a bit here. Zoom as well, you can zoom right out. Through this one I could see far more of the, the, the actual spectrum here. Um, as you can see there's a little weird activity going around here. You know, this pulsing that really affected the RTL, it really wiped out the RTL dongle. Not so much with me uh, Hacker Ref, but there I go. Got that in an, an aluminium case. So, um, well, it's really quite interesting to have a look at this. Weird kind of bleep going on here. Obviously, I'm going to have to learn a bit, a bit more about this myself. Anyway, hope that hope that helps. Anyway, thanks. Bye.